Hello, everybody. It is I, Linus. Back to you with another YouTube video. Despite everything, I am determined to beat this game. I made it just in time. Finally, I'll get the chance to impress the appster dev himself. I've got a good feeling about this. The reason you should hire me is... Spare me the practice spell. I will hire you. Only because we're the only... You were the only person to have made pro progenitor dear work progenitor dear work again. Jeez, what is it with these hard to pronounce words? The game stopped working a few seconds after you left. I want you here every time I experiment on it. Capiche? Understood. But can I play the game? The curiosity overwhelms me, sir. Go ahead. But don't expect much. It's a corrupted monstrosity. Honestly, sometimes I wish to destroy that cursed thing, but I can't. I feel like the secrets of it would give me the knowledge to make the next Deer games even greater. Once again, I hear an ominous humming. The game looks... primordial. The game turns on! I feel like my head is in a vice. My head is throbbing, but the excitement consumes me. Warning, this game is not for the faint of heart. User discretion is advised. <laughs> it's your coin, okay. Um, okay. My name is Eric. I will help you with this game. Good luck. What is... I, I I vaguely remember this. I remember it got super hard at the end. I don't remember a thing. Okay, so that's what I gotta do. I gotta find the little yellow gems. Once I find those, I can exit the level. And then it's just gonna continue and continue and continue and it's gonna get harder! Okay, so I missed a spot. It's no big deal. We can fix that. We just need the right know-how. Yeah, we gotta find the right know-how to get past this game. Do not let them get you. Do not let them get you. I forgot what them was. I've only played this game once before, so I don't remember much about it. Hmm. Must be up here. There we go. Okay, so not that way. Maybe this way. There. Do not hide. Do not, did you say? Did you say do not hide? Hmm. Jammed. <laughs> Don't remember how this ends. Hmm. I like how it keeps changing. That's like the best part about it. Pac-Man was different. Pac-Man -Pac basically just stayed the same. Oh gosh! Oh no! No, 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 no! What was that? No, no, no. 
I die. What was that? I, do, I remember it, but not like that. That was weird. It was, it was like a flying headpiece. Oh, thank heavens. Oh, hi! What are you? Looks like a... A female that's been stabbed or a monster with a really fat mouth. Either way, that's really disturbing. <laughs> oh, damn it! Okay, so there's gonna be a ceiling above me. Okay, this gives me some time to figure out my surroundings. Okay, that helps. That helps. Ah, damn it. Come on! Yes! I do not want there to be another one of those female monster thingies, whatever they are. I want to live! Please let me live! Well, that's disturbing to know. That's not good, is it? We need to get that monster out of you ASAP. <laughs> so close that time. Where is it? Oh, great, there's two of them. I figure knowing my luck, I have to see another one of those things. Whether it's a bleeding female or a freaky... Oh, wait, no, I see their eyes. Okay, so... <laughs> I'm so confused. No, no! No! Bastard! <laughs> oh, why? Run, duck, up, 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 up. Duh! I had it! I just hesitated because I was really nervous. Really makes my blood boil. Yeah, figures. It wouldn't be that easy now, would it? I know what you did. You killed her. You killed me. Well, that's a bit of lore I didn't notice before. He said, I know what you did. You killed her. You killed Mia. You guys understand that, but you understand it in a while. That is free. Where am I? Is this heaven? Or am I in hell? Am I a ghost? I wake up unable to move. I couldn't remember where I was or how I got here. I attempt to stand, Ugh, but my wrist is stuck. What is this? Oh no, I'm tied to a chair. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it figures, it figures, it figures, it figures. It totally figures. 
If you think it's fun rope stuff, this isn't. We're not even there yet. <laughs> I guess that tumor-like device in your head synced with the game, huh? Darius was beating you up when he found out about Mia. What? What is this? Gah! Come to think of it, maybe that thing in your head is made of the same stuff as the arcade game. That explains a lot. Still, Darius says you're still hired. He says he still needed you. Guess ambition trumps everything else for Dev, doesn't it? What did she mean by the tumor-like device? Am I in a dungeon? Yeah, it feels like that, doesn't it? Are you going to kill me? Where are we? Relax, sweetie pie. I'm just making sure you're safe. Safe from what? Safe from the clutches of ladies who try to steal you from me. <laughs> See, th this is why I I've never actually wanted a Yandir for a girlfriend. Granted, it would be kinky to have a girl chase me across the countryside, but in reality, I would lose all my loved ones because of her, and that would not be good for it. Okay. Isn't this a little extreme? You haven't seen anything yet. I'm prepared to go all out. I would do anything to protect my man. And if you think anyone can stop me. <laughs> Absur Inc. attacked by UFO. I love it. Oh, man. <laughs> How did I get home? I noticed something on the floor. The same tooth. Why does it keep coming back? I threw it away, right? Did I? Little bro, thank God you're safe. Hi, Lilith. D dungeon? Dungeon? The Abstract building exploded just an hour ago. It was all over the news. I was so worried. No. <laughs> no, just no. <laughs> when I heard the news, I, I just had to go home. I've been calling you nonstop since this afternoon. S sorry. Why does your phone ring anymore? Now I had to cut my outing short. Whatever. I'm just glad you're okay. Don't scare me like that, okay, bro? G Girlfriend. <laughs> Dude, make words already. A little off time with the news there. Baby bro. Don't call me that! I'm a big boy! <laughs> you have a girlfriend now? You? Wow! I haven't gone a week. No one cares, Lilith. Put pictures. Dude, stop it. Okay, let me take a look. I didn't know you were the type to take selfies with his girlfriend. You hardly take pics of yourself. Besides, I'm sure she's ugly. Wow! Aren't you just a little piece of dung? Doo dung! A little piece of doo dung shit! How dare you make fun of me! And how dare you make fun of my Yandir! <laughs> Alright, enough of that. Back to this. But whatever, let me see! S C. You're all alone in these pictures. Just you. There's no one else in here, brother. Please tell me you're joking. Please. Is everything fine? Oh my God! We have to. We have to go see the doctor. All right, brother. Hang in there. I'm gonna look for Doc. Take some medicine. We're gonna get through this. You're not helping, Lilith. Everything's gonna be all right, baby bro. Don't call me that! <laughs> your sister will make sure of it. If this has something to do with your brain tumor, we'll just make it go away again, okay? You have to be strong for me. You are the only family I have left. Doc will fix you up. I know we can. I'm sure he's here. 
Everything's gonna be alright. Stop calling me baby bro. Stop it. For the last damn time, I am a big boy. I can handle my shelf, thank you. Your sister will make sure of it. Just stay here for a while. It won't be gone long. That's a nice sky in the background. <laughs> and this is why I love this game. It seemed like a random choice game, but it got more interesting and more interesting the more I played it. And that's why I played it for this. Because it is just amazing. <laughs> it's so creepy, too. Just look at her. She's faceless. She's just inching her way toward you the more you click the screen. <laughs> it's just so creepy. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh. oh, yes. Good work, Lilith. It seems the medicine worked exactly as we predicted it would. He's completely catonic. Catatonic. Oh, whatever. Are you sure he's able to control the Trinemesis weapon? He already did. That attack on Absar went exactly as planned. Well, actually, the performance exceeded our expectations. Transferring Kara's consciousness into the device in his head? Outstanding move, Doc. You're a genius. Yeah, none of you saw that coming, did you? I knew, but I tried to hide it the best I could. Hopefully I did a good job and didn't give you any spoilers. Well, th well, that's one way of getting a killer instinct. Putting a killer's consciousness inside your head. Indeed. I was astonished at how he knocked the teeth out of me in the park. Well, technically it was Kara, but still. Now the Trinemesis under Kara's control, the end of the world is at hand. A new world shall take its place. Once the world witnesses the indestructible Trinemesis unleash its wrath, the world will unite. A world ruled by one government. Yeah, th that, that, that failed in the past. It's not going to work. A world with a manageable number of people living in paradise. How rude. Chaos brings peace. Destruction bursts new opportunities. I don't care if our organization disagrees. It's the right time. Absa, Jagger, and Jones, they can't delay us any longer. The Guidestones in Georgia have given us guidance. Doc, who would have thought the car would be the key for us to save humanity from itself? When we ended the Yandi experiments, I knew Kara was worth saving. But I must admit, I find it funny that this man here was falling for her. Did he really think she was for real? How desperate. He basically fell in love with his altar. Now, don't be mean, Lilith. You little wretching bastard, you. He couldn't discern what was real and what's not. What's the difference between reality and imagination anyway? Yeah, I know about the brain hallucinating consciousness reality theories, but still, what a weirdo. Yeah, I didn't like you either, Lilith. You can just go away now. Just leave me alone. Dakara's consciousness is, a, is as real as ours, Lilith. A complete duplicate of the real Kara Genta. Eh, what if this Kara rebels like the other one? The device that houses her is programmed to delete her should she rebel against our orders. Thanks, Doc. Shall we begin preparations? See, this is why I don't like people that play God. They act like we control the world, we cannot lose, we're gonna dominate everything. It's basically like the phone version of the government of basically the world. Any, any world, any country basically. They get a little greedy with their power, and then before you know it, they're bombing the, the capital, destroying everything. Yes, the end of the world is upon us. Rejoice! <laughs> that was so cheap looking. That was merely a demonstration of trying nemesis. <laughs> Soon a new world will arise, and we will be its creators. That's just sad. Let your mind stay at our cake shop, my love. Let it relax. 
It will be over soon. Liar! Yeah, we all knew we all knew that by the second episode. Doesn't matter. Yes, I knew you way before. I've always had a crush on you. Turns out the blank slate of you was more open to someone like me. That's not what this is about, you murderer! Really? This was your plan. You promised to do whatever it takes. You wanted this. I am a pawn. Do not blame this on me. No, no, this isn't right, Kara. You have to trust me. I don't think I can forgive you if... Really? And what if you get your memories back? You'd hate me for stopping you. And the Ruchtenstein Institute. You know what happens if I don't obey orders. I will get deleted. Not only that, you'll remember me as someone you hate. Either way, it's a lose-lose situation for me. I'm not sure that's a risk I can take. Please be rational. Wow. After this event, the whole world will have less women for me to compete over, too. You know, you belong only to me. You know, I don't deserve deletion. You know I can't take the risk. Please understand that you've already made your choice years ago. I told you, I want to start a new life. I've changed. This is not what I want now. Aside from that, you are obsessed. This is not love, Kara. Love starts when manipulation stops. True. I know my glitchy nature freaks you out. And you hate that I kill people. Oh, please, cut me some slack. Like you made me cut down Mia. Yeah, thanks, Kara. I did everything I could do so we could be together. Because that's all I can ever have what have what would have happened if you had fallen for Mia or anyone else I'm not as pretty as other girls life would have been meaningless you are literally the only person in my world you're all the friend I'll ever have and all I'll ever need this is too much you can't end the world because I used to want it things change You really believe I'll forgive you if you push through with this? You can you can just stop now. But the risks. Kara, I know you've been put in a tight spot. I'm sorry. But you have to do the right thing here. Kara, there is still a way back from this. We can forget all that's happened here. We, we can put this all behind us. Maybe I can forgive you. Maybe? You're just making risk my life? Risk the past, you hating me, and all that family's plans on a maybe? I guess that's what love is supposed to be. I just wanted to be happy. Promise me you'll find the real car for me, okay? Please take care of her. Come here, love. This is my happiness. This is where I belong. <laughs> and they ruined the moment. Uh, I think I said Ruckstein. I, I, I meant Rockstein. Oh, whatever. It's Dr. Rockstein. Now, try Nemesis. Show your true power. <laughs> I'm just ruining his voice on purpose. N no! Impossible. How are you still speaking? I'll take it from here, love. What, what the hell? How did you sound like Kara? I won't let you end this world. Impossible, Kara. Don't you dare. If you continue your insports, you will die. I'm prepared for that. I already had my happy ending. You stupid idiot! <laughs> I guess this is it. Farewell, my love. Oh, that's sad. Kara, no! The death's... The death toll surpassed the 10,000 mark. The media blamed the catastrophic event on a power plant disaster. <laughs> Don't just hate politics. Unfortunately, the public believed the sinister cover-up. 
Whoever is pulling the strings is still out there. I started working with Appster Inc. As, I, as a design consultant. Despite the busy schedule, I ensure I have enough time for my promise. Car once said that it would be nice if I could take care of the real car. I often wonder if the real one would want that. The true ending. Look at that. Wow. And this is like either months or maybe a couple years later. Nope, nope, definitely, definitely like a year or so. <laughs> Oh, make that many years later. I have wrinkles on my face. No. Time, what have you done to me? I'm old now. <laughs> Man. Kara, is it really you? <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to look those up eventually. I haven't played any of those. Man, I really want to play those now. I don't got the time. Dear Vengeance, Dear Dot EXE, The Last Yander Part 2. Oh man, I have to play that. Anyways, thank you everybody so much for watching this. And if you liked it, you know what to do. Hit like and subscribe. Do it. And like always, this is Menace Decker signing off, and I will see you, you, in my next video. Bye bye.